Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to integrate Square Payments with your WordPress in 2023. By connecting Square, a reputable payment processing solution to your WordPress site, you'll be able to offer your customers a secure and streamlined checkout experience. So this guide will walk you through the step-by-step -step process of setting up this integration, ensuring your online sales and payments processing run seamlessly. So let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch us from now till the end so you have full experience. First, we'll have to go and create a Square account if you don't have already one. You can go to the Square website and sign up for a Square account. So to do so, we'll have to go and open whatever browser we're going to use to follow the tutorial steps with. Once we do, of course, we'll have to go to this URL section. Simply now type square.com and hit the enter button. This should take you to the home screen or main screen of Square website. And of course, from here, make sure to go to the top right corner and sign in for your account if you have an account. If you don't have an account, you can always go and click on get started to create a new account for yourself. If you're not sure yet to create an account on uh, Square, you can always go and see why Square from here. Uh, let's just go back, sorry. So you can go and see always why Square or simply scroll down, read more information about it, see the reviews of other people on it online and a lot of other stuff. So as you can see, so of course why Square here, you can simply, let's just close this, helping every size of business succeeded. And as you can see, if you scroll down from here, I'm not going through all of this. You can see whatever you want. You can look all over about it. For me, I'm just going to go to my account dashboard here. So go to the dashboard. And of course, we will be good to start. Of course, for you, again, if you don't have a, if you don't have a WordPress website, you can always log in into your WordPress dashboard. And as an example, so go and open a new tab, go to wordpress.com and hit the enter button and make sure to log in into your account if you don't have an account. And if you have an account, make sure to simply uh, go log in into it. But if you don't, you'll have to go and create a new account for yourself. Once you set up your WordPress website, you will have, of course, to go and install a Square Payments plugin. In your WordPress dashboard, you'll have to navigate to the plugins and click on Add New, then search for the Square Payments plugin, such as WooCommerce Square, and install it. There is another option instead like, of starting the integration from uh, WordPress, there is an option, but it may not always work, or maybe it's not available, but you'll just check it out. This you can start the integration from Square website. So you can go to Square, go to the select panel, click on settings, click on apps integration, and click on visit app marketplace. From here, let's just go to the search box and simply from here, let's just look for uh, WordPress. So let's look for WordPress. Yeah, as you can see, we have here WordPress.com. So let's just go back. I uh, missed it. Or I'm typing it like wrong. So as you can see, yeah, we have here WordPress. So let's simply click on it. And as you can see, we have this WordPress app that we can simply start the integration from Square. So as you can see, create a website to showcase and sell your products and services. But this app is not free it's you will have to go and pay for that so you can scroll down read all the features about us the pricing you can find anything about it and then simply go and click on get started once you click on get started you'll have to simply uh, go and install this integration connect to your wordpress and you will start the integration from Word, uh, from square and as we said we can we can start it from wordpress so just access your dashboard for me this is my dashboard and here simply i'm going to plugins as we said click on add new plugin so we can install the square payments plugin here I'm just going to the search plugin here and simply I'll type square. Hit the enter button and let's see if we'll find the square. So as you can see, yeah, we have WooCommerce Square. That's what we'll need. Uh, so at the moment, as you can see, this plugin does not work for your version of PHP. Learn more about updating PHP. So I'll simply have to update my PHP and then I'll be able to download it. But for you, if you have your, your PHP is already updated, you will not have this problem. So simply you can click on that app as an example, I just go and click on that. And as you can see, this will give you like an overview about the app. So warning, this plugin has not been tested uh, with your current version of WordPress. So yeah, as we said, so we'll have to simply upgrade or update. And as you can see, uh, you'll be able to accept credit payments easily and directly to your store. This is, will support like Woo WooCommerce subscription, WooCommerce pre-orders if you have WooCommerce. And as you can see, this is going to be the version. The author is WooCommerce. 
you can see the reviews of other people here and contributors from here you can even try it first before installing if you want to so you can go to installation how it's going to be installing you can find automatic installation and manual installation and updates the frequently asked questions about this app change log screenshots as an example uh, here you'll find like the main plugin settings and the payments getaway settings so this is going to be the settings of the the plugin as you can see once you download the square app so as you can see here square you can uh, customize the plugin settings however you want and of course uh, the payments gateway uh, settings will be as this you can add uh, whatever title description transaction type accepted card logos you can do whatever you want and make sure to save the changes and you will be good to go as an example here you can see even the reviews of other people and if you want it make sure to simply go and install it for me i'm just going to click on try it first and once you click on try it first i'll just have to try the plugin of course so let's just wait for this page until it loads and as you can see from here we'll be able to try it out so basically you can go and try everything about the square app that you just installed and make sure to even like configure the payment settings as we saw said before as you want and even the getaway transaction after that you will have to go and make a test transaction before going live conduct like the test transaction to ensure that the integration is functioning correctly Make sure like payments are being processed, uh, processed and order details are currently recorded in both Square and even Workspace, your Workspace, uh, your Workspace, not Workspace. So, of course, after that, make sure to even enable the live mode once you test everything and the test is going uh, successfully. So, once you're satisfied with the test transactions, you can switch like Square integration to live mode. This means actual transactions will be processed uh, through the Square when customers make purchases on your WordPress site. You can even, as an example, monitor transactions. You can log regularly monitor transactions in both Square and WordPress dashboard to verify accuracy, ensure payments are properly recorded, and order details are synchronized between the two platforms. You can even stay informed about any updates, as you can see, so you don't have any on one of those problems that I have here. And make sure to even, uh, like, as we said, stay informed about any updates or changes related to the Square or WordPress integration. Keep your Square and WordPress account updated to ensure smooth payment processing experience for your customers and provide your customers with support, of course. So make sure to inform your customers about the available payment option so you can go to your WordPress site and add, like, a logo uh, of Square on the payments so they can know that you are accepting, like, Square payments. And, of course, make sure to even provide some clear instructions in case they have have any payments related queries or questions so if you reached the point of this video congratulations you've successfully integrated your square payments with your wordpress website enabling or enhancing the checkout experience for your customers this integration not only simplify payments processing but also build trust in your online business so by following these steps you've effectively combined the capabilities of two reliable platforms to streamline your e-commerce operation so make sure to share this tutorial with others that might find this helpful so thanks for watching if you liked the video make sure to leave a like down below subscribe for our channel for more helpful tutorials like this one and i'll see you in the next video